Have you noticed when you share a blog article on WhatsApp or Teams, the heading of the blog article, the cover image of the blog article, and an excerpt of the article is automatically rendered for most links. But how did this happen? Because the blog was mostly written in an Angular or React frontend, and before the actual JavaScript is loaded, it does not even know its title. And when you share on WhatsApp, there is no JavaScript execution. Hence, how does it even fetch the data from the server? The answer is called server-side rendering. Most React and Angular deployments, which we did in the past, were compiling the code into a build directory and hosting the build directory as a static website. While it is useful in most cases, it cannot dynamically change data without running any JavaScript. Hence, modern deployments like Next.js enable you to change your headers meta tags without executing JavaScript using the concept of SSRs or server-side rendering. So whenever you share the link, even without the body loading, the head section of the code informs the software of the image, the title, the excerpt, which can be now used by the software like WhatsApp to display the preview beautifully. If this is something new you learned today, subscribe me for more such content.